Hello friends, it's me Steffi Stephen here. It's such a joy to meet you even today in this video. So still we are under the lockdown period and I want to just gist out few things that's happening around us and that's none other than people are going and uh, facing a lot of uh, depression nowadays and uh, we've been hearing news and reading papers every day where we can see lot of suicidal attempts and lot of many problems that's happening around the globe so just a moment to think what's the basic reason behind it is that we just keep on thinking about things that's not happening in our lives and we blame our existence and that's not the conclusion for anything that's there happening out in our life my dear friends so today i want to share few instances in which you can come out of all these problems and you can lead a successful life so even today we are under this lockdown and many people have been losing their jobs and many people have been paid less and many people have been pushed out of their jobs so all these things are just running up in your mind and makes you more more and more more angry towards your family friends and everyone at home and it just destroys your peace and that's what is happening in your house today but even though all of this is happening we are also seeing on the other side a lot of deaths and we a lot of things are happening around us that th that's the main thing that's happening around us is like we are losing lot of people who we love and who we used to see in our daily lives because of this disease many people have lost many people have lost their life so even today you have to think about your existence and what you are doing right now my dear friends because it's a great blessing to be alive now yes uh trust me my dear friends it's a great blessing to be alive now because even though there are situations that's very worst around us but then god has given us the strength to be alive breathe and just walk around and i've seen many people nowadays you know uh blabbering about things that's not happening and things that's not coming in their hands so don't just don't worry about that you have to praise and thank god for giving you the strength to breathe and face this covid 19 and uh, i've seen many friends and many relatives being scared of this disease because if they have a small cold or if they have small uh, uncomfortability in their uh, body they just used to you know get this um, this uh, very bad feeling where they have like very they are like very uh, scared of death and like they are very much depressed and very much scared that whether this covid 19 has affected them and whether they would not be able to fulfill all their hearts desires and their family commitments so all this are running up in your head and it cannot hold it anymore and obviously you will have a second thought to just go and do something that is wrong so that's not the conclusion for anything your day might be worse today but there is a better tomorrow there is a better tomorrow with jesus so you have to cling on to god and hold on the promises that he has given you because lot of things that he would have prophesied among you you know unto you so these things should be fulfilled so god will not take you away until and unless he fulfills all this thing so today don't think that you are unworthy don't think that you're not able to do anything don't think that you are not able to make money don't just blabber or blame yourself for this lockdown instead cling on and pray keep you know keep praying and hold on god will surely bless you and he will pour all his blessings upon you and he will do miraculous things in your life so don't 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 blame yourself so when you blame yourself and put yourself down it will automatically take you to the next step that is depression and the next step will lead you to suicide so all this mental confusion should be to an end and you should have the physical strength and physical ability and mental strength to face all this so that's what god wants you to do it today so just cling on to god maybe few months you can be in this situation maybe few months you will be in this uh, pandemic 
problems and all but then after these few months there is going to be light someday we are not going to be under the dark for a whole lifetime so god is going to be that light in your life so just hold on and cling on to god and lead your life as a happy person be happy and make others happy god bless